How's it going everybody? Godbear here. Once again, thank you for clicking into one of my videos. We are back on the GTA 5 roleplay server. And before we jump into the video, I do just want to share with you guys that I have reassigned. So instead of Metro or SWAT, I am now back to VTD, the Vinewood Traffic Division, which the commanding officer did grant me my traffic coordinator position back, which is a supervisor role. And then that exact same day that I got reassigned, I was also accepted into a new role through the field training division as here comes a long title a field training program coordinator so we're just going to say ftpc and that is also an internal role or supervisor role um, just wanted to share that with you guys so i'm gonna let you go ahead and enjoy the video appreciate you guys for clicking into it again loving the support that you guys are providing with me so just wanted to express my appreciation for that so let's get into it i will see you guys next time Sorry, you might give us Yo, a little bit of space. Yo, uh, a hostage up? upstairs. There's a hostage upstairs? Yeah. Leo Lars? Yeah. Uh, hi Leo. Hello. I'm gonna. You mind if I take your position? All yours. <laughs> Twenty-two times eleven to partner. Whenever you get done processing, Mr. Garcia, if you will head upstairs inside the DOC building. All right, Jablau. Bringing someone into an active scene is not going to be very safe for anybody. The cocaine, like I said, we have downstairs. We can easily hand over to you in exchange for the officer. But stripper request or being able to actively put down any sort of metaphene, drugs, or anything along those lines onto another individual for you to snort is where we're going to run into a little bit of troubles. Alright, hold on. Just stay calm. Can we at least get some leeway? If we bring or get one of your requested individuals down here, can you at least remove the firearm from the officer? You can still hold on to it. That's fine. You can maintain, um, I guess, that aspect. But can we get you to just aim it in a different direction? I'll let you know. Okay, I'm going to... Just stay calm, okay? I'm going to put my arms down. I'm going to turn around. I'm going to approach the other officers. We're going to get the cocaine that you requested up here. And we'll see what we can do about contacting one of the individuals that you requested, okay? You played your bed, Mike. I'll buy it. Understood, Jablau? All right, hold on. Okay, so obviously we're not bringing someone down here, but it's worth, it's worth do you guys, obviously we're not going to actively give him any drugs either, but do you have anything that would look like drugs or yeah, anything we can just get him distracted okay, be because be the moment that, we might have some flour in the kitchen. Okay, because the moment that he goes to snort whenever, he, whenever you provide him um, is going to be our opportunity to also relay to the officer to either drop Force down to someone call or whatever unit. because if he goes to snort whatever's in the bag Force that means he's only going to have That's one yeah, arm right, on that shotgun Force him to what's up mm -hmm. um does the officer actively have his radio currently in his ear i do have the cocaine it's in possession of one of the officers behind me um will i be able to slide it up through the cell for you so we can proceed with at least that section of the exchange one Lincoln 15, uh, it was pulling in. Okay, and another give me one sec. I'm gonna go get it from the officer. I just wanted to make sure that we're clear on our intentions here, okay? All right, the strippers we're working with, okay? All right, I'm gonna be right back. I'm gonna go grab their bag of cocaine. Um, just give us three seconds. I'll be returning right back to you, okay?
Okay, go ahead and tell the officer that he can stop asking to scratch his chin because that gives him confirmation that you the fact that he's asking that, that uh, okay. I, we're aware that he's still hearing. Um, so at this point, if you want to relay to him that I'm going to give him this fake bag of uh, okay. whenever you said it was. Um, and when we actively see the suspect snort or whatever he's going to do with the drugs, we're going to say now over the radio... As soon as that officer okay. drops out of range from gunfire, we're going to load into that suspect. Okay, sounds good. All right. So, if you can relay that first, go ahead and hand me the bag. Um, I'm going to slowly approach. All right, Jablau, I'm going to toss your cocaine in the bag, okay? Lose Evidence bag's channel. got Lose kind of a tight channel. seal, uh, my, so my you're going to have to open it. Um, unfortunately, you know... It's got a zip on the back. But anyways, I'm going to toss this bag in there, okay? Yeah, Just make sure that you don't have any gunshots go off. Make sure... All right, well, hold on. What did you change your mind about? Are we taking him down? You, you can do whatever you want. You want meat? I don't actively do drugs. I don't even... I have actually never even tasted alcohol before. Well, um, you're not okay. allowed to Fair. do this job. Uh, but, but Jablau, just to proceed with what you requested, I'm going to toss the bag inside, okay? Larsa wants to go in there and need to back out very quickly. Well, Jablau, that's what we agreed upon. You can't change things on me. Sorry, I'm, I'm trying to stay within right, like yeah, you're distance good. to not make you feel uncomfortable. To be fair, I, I didn't contact anybody. I was just trying to get your bag for you. Their arrival is unannounced to me. The ball is on his way, but I was just trying to meet you halfway with your bag. Are you okay with me tossing this in through the bars for you, Jablau? Blow. I'm not going to snort any sort of drugs. Like I said, one, that would get me <laughs> suspended if not terminated from LSPD for actively taking drugs. <laughs> Jablau, if I lift my shirt, am I able to toss this bag in there and compromise with you? Okay, I'm going to toss the bag in first, and at that point, I'll undo my jacket, I'll lift Jablau. You you gotta stop changing yeah, things on me. Actually, what? I think he wants the stamp, so they're offering. If he shoots someone. Or two to last. Your tenet is safe. Oh, oh, five thousand. Oh, Jablau, come, this hold, speak theory. with me here. Time consuming. Unfortunate situation. User in your channel timed out. Right. Uh, Let's take this as well. Did you guys see the full chases that were in the, in the building? Please. Then you're up to the last temple. We can we get more inside the cell? Did you want me to do anything with someone this? Someone come cuff him quick. Then you're up to negative. Hey, can I get someone to come and drag this officer out? Mm, in the last 10 4. Someone come cuff him. him. Yeah, how about this? I'll just go past everybody yeah. who's in front of me and I'll just do it. Excuse me. Excuse me. Coming through. Excuse me. I'm gonna go ahead and pass this guy. Hello, well, Mr. Pink. Hey, um, guy. Steven, I'm, I'm the now. sneak in front of you. Quick. This is me attempting while you're on your knees, put your hands up and a gun on you, and me standing directly behind you to try and put my cuffs on your wrist as quickly as I can. Yeah, here we go. It's happening. Thank you for complying and being so quiet, sir. Appreciate it. You're, you're being really quiet, but, uh, you know, that's good. Alright, we're good. Hey, this guy has a gun! This guy has a gun! Shoot him! Kill him! He's down. Okay. If any of the medical want to take care of the rest of it, there you go. Thanks for not killing me. 
22 time 11 short last 1055 is 1099 we're gonna be back 108 on Carson Avenue appreciate the response oh Jesus shit <laughs> well that's that's gonna be another uh oh fuck He was going really fast. Yeah. <laughs> Sir, do you mind just pulling forward off to the side for a moment? I'm sorry. Go, go pull over. I uh, appreciate that, Mac. Um, I'm assuming you're Not aware Mac. of... Mac. <laughs> Not Mac. Emma, okay, sorry. <laughs> um, I'm you. assuming you're aware of why we pulled you over. Um, because um, I had a car accident with <laughs> Alex over there. And that, uh, yeah, that would be correct. Um, can I ask you how fast you were traveling? Just a moment ago? Um, yeah, I was traveling on a normal speed, but then I saw uh, that Johnny running down the street and I started braking my car, but because of the of the snow, I couldn't stop the car immediately. And it started, you know, like, like, just, it was going and I couldn't stop it. And then Alex was driving and I hit his car and yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, just sit tight. I'm going to speak with the officers in front of us, and then I'm going to return to my cruiser, and then we'll be back with you, okay? Mm -hmm. Hello. <clears throat> okay. So, <laughs> obviously, we were too far away to clock any speeds. It did look like she was going a, at least a little fast there. Um, <laughs> do you guys want to pursue any citations or just speak with her about slowing it down and obviously being more aware of her surroundings uh, okay I didn't actually clock here in the show okay <laughs> we do, I mean our car fucking clocked up us still yeah <laughs> 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 we're missing half a fucking car <laughs> alright All right, give, give me one sec I know. All right, Emma, um, I'm not going to cite you with anything. Obviously, I didn't clock you at any speeds. It looked like you were going a little fast, um, but now you have some... You said your vehicle's okay. You don't have any vehicular damage or anything? Um, nah, it should be okay. Emma. Okay. Yeah. Um, How the fuck is your car not clapped? <laughs> Look at our fucking car. <laughs> You yeah. wrapped us around a fucking train like sign. <laughs> what the fuck? I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so, that being said, Emma, um, yeah, we're not going to cite you anything. Just give you, you know, the verbal warning on making sure you are abiding by the, the speed limit. Maybe be a little bit more <laughs> aware of those surroundings. Obviously, you said you had Ganja there, um, and then you collided with the, the scout. Um, other than yeah. that, you do have two active citations. Um, if you can get those paid off before they reach their, you know, 72 hour state, so three days, just to avoid the failure to pay, it'd be appreciated. Um, but other than that, All once right. I'm back in the vehicle and the lights are off, you're free to have a wonderful day, okay? Okay, thank you. Alright, stay safe. I could be traffic endangerment. Yeah, traffic endangerment. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. Let's do that. Let's do that. Let's do It's basically yeah. destruction of government yeah. property as well now. Well, yeah. she's in your house. This makes our life ten <laughs> times easier. <laughs> I mean, up. karma served well, so it's good. Oh, Is that bad. about you lots? Just you disruptive impeding, it could be. She's eating a drag? Arrest her for vandalism now. And what is gonna happen? Right. Traffic endangerment, that's the one. What is gonna happen with that drag? We can leave it here for now. Alright, time for it. She's, she's got a knife. Officers. She's got a knife. I'm going for lethal now. Alright, our money axle on the uh, bike. 
She's down. She's fair. Okay, uh, yeah, why are we doing lethal fire? Because uh, she has a land. knife. Please disregard she goes to Vera with stabbing officers at the traffic checkpoint. Oh, and San Andreas.